The Hudson River Watershed Alliance fills a special niche uh, different than other organizations that have been working on the Hudson River for years because we were specifically formed to provide an umbrella for the local watershed groups. It's a collective group of people that care about the future of the Hudson River watershed but from New York City into the Adirondacks. We are a networking and clearinghouse organization to support the smaller local watershed organizations. This is why the river is so turbid. These are people, just regular citizens, who want to protect the stream in their backyard. And they needed a voice and they needed some help um, connecting to resources, grant opportunities, and just technical expertise of how you'd go about um, protecting your, your backyard stream. And that's really where the Watershed Alliance came about and that's where we are today. We're supporting the development of these groups and trying to help them access educational resources and scientific information and meet each other and learn from each other. The sale we're doing tonight is with Hudson River Sloop Clearwater and one of the local groups that has become very active in the region, the Quasayuk Creek Watershed Alliance. That creek, the Quasayuk, is the reason that our town exists. Well, the Kusea Creek uh, watershed here is a small urban watershed. It's been, been kind of beat up and, uh, and urbanized, and uh, they've had some real challenges. So we're hoping to really uh, bring that back, bring back both both the recognition of the watershed and also do some improvements to it. The Kusea has been a really a model, a really gold standard, if you will, for the whole Hudson River watershed. They have a dedicated group of volunteers who have done amazing things on their own, very little funding, so we want to highlight what they've done so that other watersheds around the, H the whole Hudson River region uh, can benefit from it and learn from them. So I just thought I'd give you some perspective on the significance of the area we're in. I think the Watershed Alliance has done uh, great work in contributing towards a better understanding, both scientifically um, and academically, as well as convening a variety of interests that share uh, a future, about the future of the watershed. This is an important thing that's happening here and we need to protect our water. In order to get people to protect the environment, they have to care first. And that's what creates real stewardship, having that personal connection to the river. We're developing a uh, plan for the future to grow and try to become more sustainable in terms of diverse funding sources and also to take stock of what we've achieved in the last 10 years and try to understand how we can better serve our constituents.